It's 6 o'clock, time for news. You're watching KESQ, the desert's news leader, live in high definition. This is News Channel 3 at 6. An $80 million transportation project is being debated here in the Coachella Valley. Residents from Palm Springs to Coachella have questions about the CV Link, the proposed trail for pedestrians, bicyclists, and low-speed electric vehicles that would run along the Whitewater Wash from one end of the valley to the other. News Channel 3's Scott Hennessy is live in the newsroom with more on these plans. Scott. John, we've heard concerns from people who say the trail will be too close to their backyards, that it won't be safe, or that the CV link will be washed away with the next big storm. So we went to the man in charge of the $80 million project to address those issues. The CV link is one of the most ambitious transportation projects not involving fast moving motorized vehicles in the country. The project's approximately 50 miles long, runs from Palm Springs to Coachella. It's really the biggest project of its kind in the nation. CVAG Executive Director Tom Kirk says CV Link will provide a safe path to walk, bike, or drive electric vehicles like golf carts with restricted speeds from one end of the valley to the other without worrying about cars driving by at 50 miles per hour. The idea is that there would be, in fact, no interaction between uh, pedestrians and bikes and SUVs and cars on Highway 111. The idea is that the path on the Whitewater River would go over major streets like Fred Waring and Cook and Date Palm or under them where you have bridges, the path would dip under the bridge. This is the first piece of the CV link. It was built at the same time as the new Adams Street overpass here in La Quinta, cutting underneath the bridge and running alongside the wash. And I think there are a lot of people that assume that the project is going to be running down in the bottom of the wash and that anytime there's a rainstorm the project would be washed out and that's not the case. The project is designed to be up on the levee. Kirk says more than 40 of CV Link's 50 miles will run along the river levee. He says six or seven miles will be on sidewalks or bike lanes near streets. The most challenging portion of the trail to map out is through Rancho Mirage, where golf courses and homes in the Rancho Las Palmas Country Club sit inside and atop the wash. Kirk says he's heard residents' concerns, and CVAG is taking a hard look at creating an alternate route around the golf course community. There are a lot of legitimate questions and concerns and constructive criticism out there, and we're just starting this process. The environmental review period is just starting, and we're looking for people to tell us what to look for in terms of the project's environmental impacts. The next community meeting about CV Link is tomorrow night at Coachella City Council Chambers from 5.30 to 7.30. The design is not yet finalized, but $65 million in funding has been secured for the project. CVAG hopes to begin construction within three years. Live in the newsroom, Scott Hennessy, KESQ News Channel 3.